my name's Dan and this is Cora and we're here today to talk to you about board games for children of around five and under. Today we're talking about this game. Look at the monster. What's it called Cora? Crackalaka. Crackalaka laka or in English Bugs in the Kitchen. Let's see how it plays. In Bugs in the Kitchen you're a cook at a rather dubious restaurant who's frantically trying to trap a cockroach by making an elaborate maze for it out of cutlery. Although, to be honest, it's probably best if you don't think about the logic of this game too much. On your turn, you roll a dice, then you turn whatever the result is, a knife, a fork or a spoon, in order to guide the frantically skittering cockroach towards your trap. The person who traps a cockroach a total of five times is a winner. Alternatively, you can play a little more aggressive version, where you're trying to persuade the cockroach to go towards your opponent instead. This is a really fun and silly game, and has gone down very well with adults I've played it with too. If you do get this game, then make sure you keep the Hexbugs battery nice and fresh, as nothing's as disappointing as a lackluster cockroach limping slowly around your kitchen. Yay! So Cora, do you like this game? Um, yes. What do you like about it? I like the like bug when you hold it and it's switched on. It goes yeah, it's really funny. It's got a really nice toy factor. I like, I like that bit as well. This is a game I take to my uh, normal adults um, board game meetings as well now and again yeah, because it's a lot of fun. And one of the games we did of like this game. Um, it keeps on going dad's way to my head, dad's way. Yeah, well, no, look, it took ages. Sometimes, sometimes it's over in a flash and sometimes the cockroach just, just doesn't want to move. So, I give this game two thumbs up. Cora, two thumbs up.